So this is banjo. So banjo lets you see everything that's happening around you, really any time, any place, across all the major social networks. So here we are at South by Southwest, and it's showing us all these people that are around us right now. But what's cool in Banjo is it's not only about what's happening around us right now, is we can go anywhere we want. So for example, we could go to London right now and search uh, what's going on there, let's find out what's happening. We could also go, um, excuse me, we're getting a text message here. So this is what's happening in London right now. We could also search by a keyword and in, in, in interest of ours. So for example, if, if I'm interested in talking to people that are in tech or interested in people that are into some sort of music, as I travel through life, my interests change, and therefore you can change your interests on banjo. We can also view this in, in updates. These are all the people that were in London that are sharing updates right now. These people are sharing photos on Instagram. They're, this person is sharing a, a tweet. On and on, Foursquare check-in. Uh, path updates, etc. The other cool thing is you can identify your friends and people by their photos and other Banjo users as well. And one of the most important features of Banjo is friend alerts. Friend alerts let you know when the, your friends are nearby, even if they're not on Banjo. So we know when you come into Banjo, if you're on Foursquare or Facebook, we're watching your friends so that when they uh, check in somewhere, do something public, we notify you that they're close by. So for example, here are all the friends that are close by here within the last 30 minutes. Here at South By, I want to cast a wider net, but if I'm home, let's just say, somewhere dense like New York, I can change the distance. So I only want friend alerts if they happen, let's just say, within a quarter of a mile of me. Also, if I'm in a meeting or something of importance going on, I can pause the alerts so that I'm not getting push notifications during the, that time. And that's Banjo. Mm -hmm. So can you tell us a little bit more about where you see this going in terms of the direction of the app? Yeah, so the direction of the app is about push search. It's about search uh, giving the search results to you without you actually having to search for them. This phone and the and the platform that is Banjo is smart enough to know that when you travel, that if it's your friends that are nearby, maybe it's your favorite band that's playing nearby, uh, maybe it's something else of personal interest to you is nearby, that you should get that notification without you having to do anything. And so that's what Banjo, that's what the platform does, and that's what we'll be showing the world. Awesome. Thank you so much. Thank you.